Hi, welcome back to my channel. This is Designs by Emma and I'm Emma. Today we have an unboxing for you. Before we get there, full transparency, this product was gifted to me. However, all thoughts and opinions are my own. Uh, so let's look what we're unboxing. We are unboxing this beast. This is the Instant Pot Duo Crisp with Ultimate Lid. It's a multi-cooker and air fryer. And the way this differs from the Pro Crisp is this right here is the air fryer lid and pressure cooker lid all in one. So there is no storing of a second lid, which I know for some people is a really big deal. Um, so let's get into the box. Okay, so here we go. I've undone the tape. You are literally seeing this as I see it. So apologies for any dodgy angles. Uh, so this inside, we have got uh, the quick start guide, um, which will basically just tell you how to plug it in, I believe, and how to, you know, your do's and don'ts. Um, but there is a QR code this time um, and instant brands are trying to go as paperless as possible. So your full instruction manual will be on here on one of these QR codes. Uh, so that's that. And then have polystyrene. You might hear a dog bark in a moment because I'm chucking the polystyrene on the floor and he's in here with me. Ah. Rip off the packaging. I think this is a two handed job. So let me pop you down a second. Okay, so I've taken it out of this box. It's still got its wrapping on it, you can see. Let's get all of this off and see what we're working with. So we've got a bit of tape here holding the water um, collection pot, which is actually recessed in this machine. Uh, I wondered how that would work. We've got the fixed flex, uh, which we had on the Pro Crisp. If we turn it this way, this is the front of the pot. Now this here is a lock mechanism. So as you can see, the padlock's on lock and this is unlock. You pull it across, oh, and you have to sort of, you pull it across and you can feel like a barrier and then you push past that and the lid lifts. Ooh. So inside we have got, what do we got with it? Got the air fryer basket. Um, I don't know if you can tell, but this, um, new, this model um, is a smaller size basket capacity. It's 6.7 litres opposed to my 8 litre, uh, but it's shallower and wider. So it should be better for getting more surface area, which I know a lot of people have complaints about with the other ones. Um, so we then got the main inner pot, stainless steel as always. Um, a bit of paper in there. Um, and then the inside of the pot just looks as a standard instant pot does. So that goes in. You've already got your feet attached to your basket. There's no dehydrator rack in this one, which we did get with the Pro Crisp. Um, got a sticker on here, so we'll um, peel that off. This, I'm believing, is the, this one needs to get washed anyway, um, this is the pressure cooker part of the lid, um, so I believe this just pulls out, maybe it doesn't just pull out, I'm going to have to have a read and see how, ah, there's a button, we've got this red button here, and that, you can see here, releases the pressure cooker lid, so this is your pressure cooker lid, uh, so it's sort of, what you would normally see on the top of a regular pressure cooker tip lid, we've got the float valve, um, we've got the ceiling valve there. Um, but yeah, that's very heavy actually, quite heavy. Some things bear in mind. Um, the ceiling ring doesn't appear to be removable. So it'll be interesting to see how that wears when you're doing savoury and sweet because these can pick up fragrances um, from your food, especially if you cook a lot of curries or stews meaty dishes particular um so we'll see how that works um and then obviously we'll have the air fryer lid um and that is it let me pop it down lock it in place like i said if you can put it here you do sort of hit a barrier and you come across from that let's see how easy it is to get back in so there's a little nudge at the bottom of the lid there you're going to sit that in and it just pops into place so that's really super simple um, just for a size comparison, you really have got to push that down. Um, I quite like because it means it's secure. Excuse me, on your head. So that is the ultimate lid. Let's scooch him over there. And if I get to Pro Crisp, this is the 8 litre, don't forget. So this will be a slightly bigger. Um, but this is the pressure cooker lid. So it's similar sort of, similar sort of size, really. Um, but then the difference with the Pro Crisp, of course, is you have to store this piece. This is the air fryer lid for it. So that's how it differs um, from one machine to the other. 
Um, I suppose also a thing to know, um, obviously this doesn't fit under my unit, but I can store it under the unit and when the pressure cooker lid's on, I can actually open it under the unit as well. Um, but with this, obviously being a hinged lid, I'm not going to be able to pressure cook under there because this has to be able to lift. Um, so you need to have a kitchen where you have an open workspace that's not under a cabinet. Um, I know some people use glass protectors on a, on a hob. Um, it's not recommended to do that, but if that's all you've got, that's all you've got at the end of the day, I suppose. Um, but yeah, that is the ultimate lid for a crisp, in essence. Um, I shall have a play with it now, and I will let you all know in the next video what I think of it.